Now, driving along Thomasville Road in Northeast Tallahassee, this massive project might have caught your eye, but what is it? Well, it turns out it is only the third building of its kind to be built in the state of Florida. Yeah, it's the state's newest temple of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. I dug into why they are building here and how this temple will draw visitors from as far away as Alabama. Along Thomasville Road, there are many places of worship. Bradfordville First Baptist, St. Peter's Cathedral, Cornerstone Presbyterian, to name a few. <laughs> Now, less than two miles off I-10, a new temple is reaching 125 feet into the capital city sky. It's a place where members of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints go uh, to, to find uh, you know, spiritual uh, growth and a spiritual foundation. Ben Smith is stake president for the Tallahassee area. So a stake is like a sort of a diocese in, in other churches. It's uh, the local leader for various congregations. He leads the just over 3,600 members of what's also known as the Mormon Church in the Tallahassee area. This includes parts of South Georgia, Thomasville, Cairo, Madison, Perry, and Crawfordville. We recognize that simply the, the physical building being present you know, will be a, a great asset to the community. The church says temples are different than meeting houses like this one already in Tallahassee. Temples are places specially set apart for sacred services and ceremonies. Historically, uh, members would travel to Utah, which uh, it, several decades ago, that's where the closest temple was. But that's not where all Mormons live. People don't realize, I think, that Mormons are a much more expansive denomination than it would first appear. <laughs> Dr. John Corrigan is a distinguished professor of religion at Florida State University. The last five years, Mormon growth has been either flat or negative. Um, I understand the preliminary statistics indicate that there's a resurgence the last year or so. The church says Florida is home to more than 160,000 Latter-day Saints in 267 congregations. The new temple going up in Tallahassee could potentially attract more people to visit the Big Bend from as far west as Mobile and as far east as Jacksonville. Would members uh, participate in a temple trip? You know, they travel. It's, it often is a, is a day-long trip and some things extend over into the night with hotel stays and things like that. And this project has a big footprint. This building's going to be 30,000 square feet when it's done. We are gathered for the groundbreaking. After breaking ground June of last year, the church says there are over 160 operating temples in countries around the world. They just announced a fourth in Florida that will go up in the Tampa area. This project, just a small part of that growing number. And though they couldn't tell me how much this project is costing, they did say temple construction is paid for with tithing funds from the church.